88 days into 2024, which means it is World Piano Day. That's because pianos have 88 keys. The day was created to promote the development of music and to share the joy and playing of the piano. Yeah, so if you have an ear for music, experts say you can teach yourself how to play. If not, maybe just enjoy listening to others. <laughs> I was waiting on like I, a, I like piano music. It's, it's nice and relaxing. Maybe I was just feeling zen. Do you know how to play any <laughs> instruments? Um, maybe just you know I can actually play Mary had a little lamb on. I can. Oh, hot, I can do that. I can do hot cross buns on the piano. You get me sick enough. I can play the nose flute. That's that's or that's chopsticks. <laughs> the nose I, flute? I don't know if I can play chopsticks. What's I can do uh, one of the Beethoven things. Just the initial beginning. <laughs> That's can you tell me what a nose flute is, Aaron? Yeah, you know when your nose is stopped up and you just oh, like... Oh, okay. Oh. <laughs> so nose one of those little guitar. kid things. Perfect. <laughs> Waking up this morning, we've got those temperatures sitting in the 20s and the 30s uh, from South Central out towards Southeast, even seeing some areas of fog to start off the morning. Uh, 11 degrees in Dillingham. We do have some snow out towards Cold Bay while ADAC is holding on uh, to some of that rain showers this morning. We've got rain, snow, and wind set to impact the Aleutians through the day. Uh, that's eventually going to build into southwest where we do have winter storm watches and then bringing the return to rain and snow to south central as we welcome in uh, your weekend. This morning, those temperatures holding near freezing. Just be prepared for some slick road conditions across south central. Uh, as we head into the afternoon hours, that sun will begin to shine or peek through those clouds and we'll see temperatures warming back into the upper 30s uh, and the lower 40s. Still holding on to uh, fairly quiet weather across mainland Alaska. Uh, we do have an area of low pressure through the uh, uh, bearing that's going to continue to weaken, not really bringing any impacts outside of some gusty conditions uh, for Gamble as well as St. Lawrence Island, but it's out towards the Aleutians. This is a system we're watching that's already bringing rain, snow, and winds to the islands. Uh, southwest Alaska, there's a winter storm watch for you for snow and winds increasing overnight. Uh, into your Friday and then for South Central and Southeast, we'll see rain and snow arriving uh, as we welcome in the weekend with some gusty winds. Now, a wintry mix can be expected for South Central uh, while rain can be anticipated for Southeast as we welcome in uh, the weekend. So as that low continues to move to the Northeast, we're gonna see increasing clouds later today for Southwest Alaska. Uh, those snow showers arrive overnight into tomorrow. Be prepared for four to six inches of accumulation. A gust of 40 miles per hour could lead to some lowering visibility. And then as that system continues to build eastward, we're going to see a, a rain, snow building in across south central. Uh, as we welcome in your Friday afternoon and then Saturday, uh, looking to be more widespread uh, across the region. So watching for that rain, snow mix as we welcome in your Friday afternoon, Saturday, and Sunday. Beyond Easter, we're going to see all snow as those temperatures drop back into the 30s uh, across south central. We're going to be talking about some days next week could be seeing those highs uh, right around 32 to 35 degrees. Bringing your attention to the amount of snow we've seen so far this season, 123.4 uh, inches so far, uh, so far, still the second snowiest uh, season uh, on record when it comes to the amount of snowfall. And you can see some normal season to date, about 72.4 inches of accumulation. So we have certainly seen a very wet winter and we do have that potential for more snow. Uh, into the weekend and next week. Afternoon hours today, warming into the 30s and the 40s with some sunshine possible uh, for parts of South Central, mostly sunny skies through Prince William Sound. Uh, this is where we're going to see that better opportunity for uh, sunnier conditions for the rest of the day. Uh, 46 in Gold Canada, the valley holding on to mostly cloudy skies through the afternoon hours. Uh, upper 30s and lower 40s can be expected for you with overnight lows dropping into the 20s. Uh, so be prepared for some slick conditions across South Central. Uh, that seven-day forecast, today is going to be the nicest day of the next several. We do see those clouds thicken up tomorrow. Uh, winds beginning to increase as we welcome in your Friday afternoon. There's that wintry mix Saturday tapering off by Sunday afternoon. Uh, and then into next week, there's that cooler weather. Temperatures back in the mid-30s with a chance for some snow. Tuesday, a high of 33. All right, thanks, Aaron.